Yes, that's Jubilee here, and there's a new batch of icons amongst us at Kotcha, Inzaghi, and Ferdinand. And with that, they've got some slightly newer requirements to before. Obviously, we're back to the two week cycle now, I assume. Kotcha is 90 overall with five Nigerians, Inzaghi is 92 with five Italians, and Ferdinand's 94 with five English. As people's overalls are going up, I guess they're increasing the overall limit required for um, claiming the icons because realistically the icons are semi easy to claim once you once you've got to like a 90 i know a lot of people like that 95 plus team now especially anyone who's playing with the recent freeze event that's boosted up a lot so it kind of makes sense that they're increasing them now that obviously it is what it is icons i've literally once we've claimed all these we'll have a full icon squad not that i'll be using them all the time because I don't know about me, and maybe it's just me. I'm kind of getting bored of the icon design. Uh, the icon design is nice at first, but I'm sort of just a bit mad by it now. Maybe it's because the pictures are obviously still portraits rather than like dynamic shots. I don't know. They're just in my lineup. I don't know. It is what it is. But what we're gonna do? We're gonna open a bundle today. Um, what we what's that one? That's an extra icon pack. That's an extra um, elite on the top of it. We'll open the 10k one. Why not? Because we'll get some XP and all that along the way. Um, and obviously we're going to be able to claim them all anyway but it'd be nice if we could actually pack an icon because we haven't actually packed an icon yet this year um, I say that like it should be an easy thing to do Damian, Onoma, Sekulin, Marshall and Morrison no start um, I'm feeling a little bit rough today obviously I went out last night for my birthday M&EK uh, get ourselves some Nigerians although we've already picked some Nigerians up actually I think I've got all the players required to put into the team to actually make them, which I'll show you guys. Um, Harry Winks and Air City. Um, I forgot that with these icon packs, you always have an increased chance of buying, getting players from the countries of the icons. Uh, Foddering, um, nothing of worth. Pack number five, the halfway point. Is there going to be any delight in this first? Uchi, Williamson, Success, and Glenn Murray. Not really then. Second half of these packs coming along now. Sheepy, Igbun, Abassi. Abassi's a striker, is he? Okay, cool. Didn't realise Abassi was a striker this year. Um, I hadn't looked at him, to be honest, though, so that's probably why. Daniels, Obi, Simon, Sensei. Okay. We're not really getting much from this bundle, are we? Um, hopefully, something comes in one of these final packs. Otherwise, we're going to have to hope for a big elite to save us at the end. Um, all hopes on that elite that comes from the topper at this stage. Um, I know, but I guess we could get something now. No, we couldn't. Tavra and Nusa. Okay, here's the final pack before the topper. And in this we're going to get Antonelli, Lazari, Igboon and Umar. No, then nothing. Alright, time for the topper and this is an elite. So sadly still no icon packed. The quest goes on and we get left wing 84 and singer. Okay, that's a better one, 84 rated. That's cool, that's cool. What does he go for? Insigne is going for about a million. Okay, I was expecting maybe a little bit high 84, but left wing obviously there's the free Ronaldo, so they're, they're a bit lower there. But let's put ourselves some Nigerians in and join the party and get Okacha in our team. I'm just assuming I've got them in these positions. And let's have a look. Umar's, Umar's Nigerian. Um, have we got any centre mid? Yeah, we got Obi, didn't we? Uh, let's have a look. Where's Obi? And I think we got some others. Obi, Obi, Obi. Can't you see? Sometimes your words just hypnotise me. Where are you? Where are you? There you are. You was hiding. You weren't hiding. You were there, right there in front of me. Centre back. Any centre backs? Um, he's one. He's one. How many got? One, two, three, four. And we've got a striker. Uh, yeah, we have. Can we just talk about the strikers? There he is, a Barsi. So that's what we need for the Nigerians. Obviously, if you want, they're the Nigerians. I've used Obi, Abasi, Umar, Troost, Ikong. One thing I do recommend if you are looking for Nigerians or any nationality of fact and you're not sure, obviously, we've had the recent FIFA render database. However, there's no search functionality on that. What you can use, and what I've said recommended before, is you use the Foothead website. So obviously, it's only console at the moment. I believe there's the their mobile stuff still in the works, and when it's coming. But you can use the Foothead console for this. It works just the same way. 
Um, because the database are pretty much more or less the same. All the plays more basically are. Just go play a filter. Go to, um, we've clicked on work rates there. Uh, play a filter. Nation, obviously you've got the main nations here, so most of them. But then you just need to scroll down to the ends. And where are we are, here we are in Nigeria. It's going to pop them all up and uh, get rid of the work rates. We don't need to know about them. And here you can quickly find um, nationality. So it's as simple as that, Umar, right, mid. Normally the positions are more or less the same for all of them. So you can just check here. Um, obviously there's a list of all of them. Pick them up. So go to foothead.com. Just go latest. Do play a filter here. Search by the nationality that you're looking for. And jobs are good. And you can see what they are. They're literally more or less. Sometimes the ratings are a little bit different. But for most of them, the play position is always the same. And jobs are good. And you've, you've gone to the market. You've picked them up. You've got them in your team. You pop back over to events. You pop into the icons tab. You pop over to a Kotcha, JJ the man. You claim, you wait for him to pop up. Here he springs into action with a Rabona and he's in your, he's in your club. Welcome to the club of Kotcha. Now we need to go get some Italians in there. So we repopulate straight away. We know we've got ourselves Maldini. He can be used from previous. We've got Benucci. And let's just use what's going on. Okay, we've got to wait a little minute. We'll pull Benucci in there, who's had a little, little, little level up. Um, Italian, 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 Italian. Where's an Italian? Where are you? Not left mid. We've definitely got some centre mids Italians, surely. Surely. Come on down. You, where you at? Milan Savage isn't, but he plays in Serie A. Storaro, he is Italian. Um, have we got any cams? All right, so we've got Conte at right mid. That's one, two, three, four. Probably got a striker somewhere. Right, so here we go. We've just pulled five Italians from our club. Um, Conte, Gastardello, Storaro, Maldini and Benucci. Uh, it's at 98. We don't need to go to the store. And then here we go, ready to claim 87 in Zarge. So... Inzaghi joins the fold. There we go, 87 Inzaghi. It looks like he's got some pretty nice shooting. 97 shooting. Obviously not the quickest in the world, but um, it is what it is, you know, you know. Now we need to pull some English in. So we've already got Ali. Ali. Daddy Ali. Um, and we know we've got Chrissy Coe in there. We've got ourselves the where's he yeah where's he yeah where are you hiding english man where are you at um Feeney, nope ari winks joins the fold in defense we can pull ourselves up selector with Manchian. and whilst we got hiding around here akin fen with a big man Big man, I can find one, two, three, four, five, ninety-nine red balloons go live. Events, icons, and Ferdinand looks really, really good. Ferdinand looks really, really, really good. Um, and he's joining. I don't know. I may even look to bring him into my first team. Although I've started to get some really good centre backs now, but Ferdinand looks really, really, really good. Uh, he's got some nice pace, defending, physical. He's got those stats that you want from a, from your centre back. Um, looks really, really, really good. So that's the three icons claimed. Those are the teams I've used. Just literally slot them in. Obviously, I've claimed all three of them on my road to glory as well. That's a bit of a spoiler alert. So you can see I've done it that way. Uh, but best thing to do is literally just pick out the lowest rated positions in your starting eleven, and then replace. Put the, put them in that them spots because they're the spots that you can afford to lower the best because they're already lower rather than sacrificing the big spot like for me would it make sense for me to sacrifice Ali because Ali's like a good like ten or so levels above everyone else so he's giving me the most pr position like a plus ten on him alone to the rest of them is almost an overall in itself um, with each overall obviously being ten points but um, do leave a like if you enjoyed it subscribe if you're new here come follow me on Twitter at Jobling HD. And if you need to find out nationalities, just use Foothead. It's as simple as that. Peace.